that's in the church, whether that's in politics, whether that's in government, wherever that might be, wherever God sends you, I'm believing God's going to promote you. Because we need people who believe in Jesus Christ to be the leaders of this land. And you have a calling to be like an Esther, to go and save God's people, to influence governments and departments and all kinds of places for God. And God is sending you out like arrows. Hallelujah. You're sent out like arrows. Yes. And God has an assignment for each one of you. Thank you, Jesus, for your heart. And just like the pastor said today, guard your heart with all due vigilance. It is the wellspring of your life. Don't let anyone bitter you. Don't let unforgiveness trip you up. Keep your hearts pure because then you're going to be more than victorious. Hallelujah. Amen. 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 Praise the Lord. Lord. We want to thank God for what God is doing this evening. And I know that, that he has started you with perfect. I want every one of us to stretch forth our hands to this place. I want us to begin to declare, let's pray, let's pray jointly, to begin to declare that every confusion, everything that is not of God, every argument in the spirit, let's begin to pull it down. Let's declare that this ones will not miss ever. In the name of Jesus, it does not matter what they look like in your face, but the Lord is here this afternoon. Let us begin to declare that as they sleep tonight, the Lord will minister to them. In the name of Jesus, every bitterness be uprooted. Everything that is not of God, we uproot. In the name of Jesus, we set forth this one. In the name of Jesus, Daddy, we pray that these are your Deborahs, these are your Hesters, these are your David of our days. In the name of Jesus, they will be sons among stars. They will not be pulling out of faith. In the name of Jesus, they will stand tall like Daniel. The hand of God will be upon them. In the name of Jesus, generation we call them blessed. In the name of the Father, in the name of the Son, in the name of the Holy Spirit. In Jesus' name we have agreed together. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Amen. I live with you, the Psalm 150, verse 6. Let everything that happened. Yes. Only in Christ there is life. Life in the word of God. Yes. I live anywhere you are, anywhere you go, it's only God that gives life. Yes. I say the life that is in you, use it and praise the Lord. Amen. The road will be open for you. Amen. Every obstacle in life with the word of God, the spirit of God, the power of God, the authority of God. There's no way any boundary, any bondage, any stone, every stone by the word of God it will make way for you. Live wherever you are, ask God in any situation, ask God. For help. Ask God, help me. Help me any way you find yourself in trouble, in confusion. Open your mouth because there's life in you. Ask God for help. God will send help for you. The Spirit of God behind you, open your mouth. I ask God for help. He will help you. And his name shall be glorified. We thank you for these children that you have made them a stone. You have made them a rock. You have made them a light. And go and shine for God. No obstacle, every obstacle will be uprooted. Go with the power of God. Go with the spirit of God. Go with the seal of the 
authority of God. Hear your word to embrace you. Thank you, Lord, for taking away the heart of stone and give them a heart of flesh. Father, we give you all the praise. And I want us to pray in the name of Jesus. That the things that destroy others will not destroy our children in the name of Jesus. Father, we pray in the name of Jesus. That things that destroy other children will not destroy them. Father, Lord, as they stand this hour, Lord, they are planted in the altar of God. Father, we use them as a point of contact to reach all the children out there, Lord. Father, we pray that you will visit them, you will touch them, transform their heart from inside outside in the name of Jesus. We pray, Lord, this hour you will, for the four corners of the earth, oh Lord, we stretch our hands. Father, Lord, we use them as a point of contact, oh Lord, those on the street, oh Lord. Father, we pray, Lord, that you will visit them. Father, Lord, breathe upon them in the name of Jesus. Father, we pray for the youth in the prison that be forgotten, oh Lord. Father, Lord, remember them this hour in the name of Jesus. Amen. Father, change them, oh Lord, from the prison to the street, oh Lord. Amen. From a prisoner to an evangelist in the yes. name of Jesus. Father, break them and met them the way you want them to be in the name of Jesus. Amen. Father, Lord, we pray for those children in the hospital, Lord. Some have been there for so many months, oh Lord. The doctor cannot really diagnose what actually wrong with them. But this hour is our wow visitation. Father, visit them. Heal them. Deliver them, oh Lord. In the name of Jesus. Amen. I will also pray for the babies in the incubator, Father, Lord. The king of heaven that can do all things. Father, we pray, Lord, that you will visit them. Amen. Visit the new babies, oh Lord. Father, heal them. Deliver them in the mighty name of Jesus. For when we came here, we just came not knowing what to do. But by your grace, Lord, you have done through this youth what you have prayed for today. For that we say thank you. Lord, you have communicated to us through them. And Lord, we pray in the name of Jesus, they will grow the more. In the name of Jesus. Lord, we pray, Father, as we, the ministers, have prayed tonight, wisdom, understanding, shall be poured unto them. Heaven will be opened unto them. Even as they live here. In the name of Jesus. There will be children that will be attentive and listening to their parents. In the name of Jesus. We pray for the ministers of God, all the people that have come from different directions. Lord, we pray for Johnny Mercy. In the name of Jesus. Everybody came here. There was no event. There was no story. So shall it be that all our guests that have come from distance, Lord, they will arrive from. And they say, love your neighbor as you love yourself. So my prayer today for our youth is that the grace of God in their life will help them to love, not as the world loves, but that a cup and love. Love that you love in spite of. And that the Lord will help them to grow in the nature of Christ, which is love. So, Father, today we ask you for more grace upon the life of our children, O oh Lord. Father, Lord, you will teach them how to love. Because your word says, love covering multitude of sin. As they grow in love like yourself, O oh Lord, may they, O oh God, feel the way you feel. What it hurts your heart. Will it hurt the heart of our children? Amen. So that they will walk according to your ways, according to your prison, according to your status in the name of Jesus. And of all, oh God, we ask, oh Lord, that you will bless them mightily and grant them that.
Jesus Christ. Father, the grace of God to finish well, you will grant unto me. That this was of God, none of God, Jesus says, those the Father has given unto me, no chastenance them again. Lord, none of them shall be missing on that day in the name of Jesus. Lord, our desire and prayer concerning them, oh God, that they will spend eternity with you when they are raised on this earth in the name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Father, for in Jesus' name.